Hi, I'm Aaron Tveit. Hi, I'm Karen Olivo. And we're here talking about Moulin Rouge on Broadway. Moulin Rouge is the stage adaptation of Baz Luhrmann's movie, Moulin Rouge. And we've been able to look at his movie and re-examine it for the stage and bring it to life with, uh, with the conventions and the tricks of, of the stage. I am Satine. I am the most sought after courtesan and performer in Paris. She meets this wide-eyed, lovely gentleman. I play Christian. I'm a writer from late 1800s America who sought out artistry and passion and love in his life and finally finds himself in this kind of Narnia of all of those things and uh, I see this 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 being and immediately fall in love and uh, go forth with hope and optimism and love and in a world where not everyone does that. We've added a lot of music to the canon of the show, um, essentially taking Baz's vision that he had for his movie and um, just sort of grabbing the ball and running with it. You know, one of the things for me every night I love watching is Roxanne. People get so excited when Roxanne starts, and then to see what Sonia Taya did with Roxanne, they get even more excited because it's surprising to them. So that kind of thing where you kind of take an expectation and then kind of twist it and heighten it, that's the most thrilling. And having that allowance from Baz has been really freeing for us too, to, to be able to have the allowance to turn something around and turn it over, you know, it's been really great. When people come to sit down, they're going to experience a lattice of brilliance. People have told me, I've never in my life, and this happened all the time in Boston, mm -hmm. I have never gone to see a show, walked out and gone back to the box office to buy tickets for the next yeah. night. I heard that at least 15 to 20 times. Mm -hmm. We are blowing people's minds. That's what we're doing here. We are changing people's lives. We're making people really happy. It's like the movie on steroids. steroids. And it's also really funny and smart and sexy. It's incredibly sexy. Yeah.